Hello and welcome to another AIC video. Uh, just another quick one for you guys uh, today. So I bought myself something that I'm pretty excited for. Uh, it's not the first time I've owned this uh, particular type of device, but it is. Um, I was able to buy this one at a pretty good discount for a special reason. We'll talk about that here in a second. But it's in really nice uh, cosmetic damage for the, uh, cosmetic uh, shape for the most part, uh, and like keyboard barely looks used or anything like that. Uh, what it is is a 25th anniversary ThinkPad. These came out a few years ago, 2017-ish, um, and I picked one up uh, the next year uh, as a refurb from Lenovo, and I really enjoyed it. But I ended up selling it because I'm stupid. I wanted something more powerful, but really it is sufficient for my needs. Um, I love typing on it. Uh, but I sold it thinking that uh, I get some money back for it, and I was actually able to sell it for more than what I paid for it at the time. Uh, but I saw this one, I just have a standing uh, alert on eBay. Uh, but let me show you the reason why I was able to get it for so cheap, and we'll talk about it a little more here in a second. But uh, this is the screen. <laughs> Uh, it's going to be hard to see kind of in this light, but you can see there's a big old crack that runs along here. Um, the screen is is trash. It's super broken and does not work. And I was really worried that I'd bought a piece of junk because it wouldn't boot and display to out the um, HDMI port. So fortunately, I have a dock that is compatible with it from the old one I had. I had it still laying around. And if I go ahead and power this on, it boots up and displays on the screen. So uh, hopefully the not putting out to the HDMI port, and I don't know what this music means. So I'm gonna have to do some, some research on that. Um, I don't have a keyboard plugged into it. I just did this just now. I don't have a keyboard to plug into it. It does not have an operating system, so I'm going to uh, install. It doesn't even have a storage device, so I have an NVMe SSD here to go into it. I believe this supports NVMe SSD. I hope it's not uh, a SATA 3 drive. Um, it is a M.2 drive, so we'll see if it supports that. Uh, and if it does, we'll install an OS on it. Uh, currently, this is what the screen looks like. or the lack of screen. So that's the hole that the screen's gonna go into. I did order one. Um, the reason why I took the screen out first and foremost is I wanted to order a screen as fast as possible. And I've ordered wrong screens before and I verified off the screen the part number and the flu. And then one thing that, uh, if you're watching this, you know anything about these 25th anniversaries, I believe this is a separate part so I'm going to have to see if I can find a replacement because taking this off, a lot of the clips along the sides, the top is good and the right hand side has most of its clips, but the left hand side, all the clips broke. And I was being as absolutely careful as possible. They just snapped, which isn't uncommon. So I'm going to see if this works. If it doesn't work and stay flush, then I may have to buy a new one of these. Um, it does have some QR codes with some numbers on there. So we'll see if I can find a replacement. So that's... Uh, a project I have going on. I have like nine different projects going on at any given time. So um, we'll see how this goes. Um, the screen has already been shipped. Uh, I believe it's in Tennessee right now. So waiting for that to show up. Uh, if you have any thoughts, comments, or questions on this uh, 25th anniversary ThinkPad, as you can see, keyboard looks almost unused. Like it really does look like uh, it was very lightly used, if used much at all. Um, so pretty excited to have it in my in my collection so anyways thank you for watching